I'm just gonna start off. I washed my face in the bathroom, but I forgot to film it. Sorry. I'm just gonna do my skincare. So this is like the time that I'd wake up for school if I had to like shower. You might be like, why are you waking up two hours before you leave? First of all, I don't like being rushed in the morning, especially not on my first day. I'm giving myself a bunch of time and it's like, I don't have a problem really getting up in the morning. Like, yeah, I'll be a little tired, but I don't like snooze my alarm. You know, like I'll, I'll get up. Also, I'm out of my serum. I'm very sad about that because I love this stuff. And I also have to film, so I want to give myself more time. I fixed my lunch last night, and we went to Trader Joe's yesterday. My lunch is so good. I'm not trying to brag, but like, it might be the best one in the cafeteria. I'm torn between having an acai bowl for breakfast or having like eggs and toast. Obviously, I want the acai bowl more, but like, what's gonna, what's gonna keep me more full? I don't know what time my lunch is at. I think I go to third hour, or no. I think I go to fourth hour, and then during fourth hour, we go to lunch and then go back to fourth hour. Also, does someone want to tell me where the lid of my Stanley is? Because I have no idea. Also, I don't even have my first day outfit picked out. <laughs> I have some, like, ideas, but I don't know. I've never waited this long to have an outfit. Also, guys, I got an Octobuddy to put on this phone case. I've noticed, and I don't know why, but I feel like I have really bad time management skills in the morning. It's, it, whoa. Because it's 520. I haven't done anything. I did my skincare and that's it. I don't know if it's too early to start doing my makeup. I'm getting picked up at 655. I'm aiming for 7. Guys, I'm not even kidding. I just messed up my entire video because my camera is dumb sometimes, respectfully, and it doesn't like to record long videos and I have an 11 minute clip of me getting ready and talking about everything and it's not gonna go into my video. So basically, given that I have time, I'm gonna sit down and tell you guys what basically the rundown of today is. First of all, I'm gonna show you my little makeup routine because it got cut out. And of course, of course it did. I started with my Bioma Moisturizer and my Lumi Glotion. And then for blush, I used the Glossier Cloud Paint in the shade Storm. This stuff is almost out. I've had it for three years. Wait, that sounds disgusting. I think I've had it for two. And then I used the e.l.f. Halo Glow Beauty Wand Contour in the shade Medium Tan. And then the Physicians Formula Bronzer Palette. It's like the multicolored one. And then pieces of my bronzer came out and I'm very mad about that. And then I also used the e.l.f. Blush in the shade Bright Pink. And I don't really think that this shade looks the best on me, but like it's what we have right now. Then I used the e.l.f. Halo Glow Beauty Wand Highlighter in the shade Champagne Campaign. I just used these brushes. They're all like the same... Brush. So I was saying um, after my Charlotte Tilbury setting spray runs out I really 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 want to get the Urban Decay like all-nighter one I've heard that one is really really good and like this one was good But I haven't tried any other setting sprays to like compare it to I want to do my lashes I have a fresh eyelash curler that I've only used once I have a fresh mascara that I've only used twice and I'm so hyped to do my eyelashes But I'm also scared because they have to look good. Yeah, I'm not gonna try to let the whole my get ready with me didn't record ruin my whole mood this morning but I'm like this close to. Okay, so basically the view is not gonna be good. I'm doing my lashes. And I got my mirror. I didn't have time to get my nails done or even do my nails, so they are ugly. Okay, I just love, I curled this eyelash. I just love the fresh curl that a brand new eyelash curl gets. Like, it's perfect. It's perfect. I'm gonna tell you guys the rundown of this morning. It's currently 541, so I've been really, like, procrastinating this morning but I've been taking my time and I feel like it's fine because I have enough time except I do need to pick up my outfit like I don't have it picked out I have ideas in my head but I don't have a genuine like a full idea picked out I'm getting picked up by my older cousin and then my younger cousin who's gonna be a freshman this year they are coming to my house at like 7 in the morning even though school starts at 7 40 because I think he's taking us to like the gas station or McDonald's or something he's taking us somewhere before school and then we're gonna go to school and then at 7 40 like when the bell rings and everything we have a pet fest so we'll all be in the gym until 8 30 and then a pep fest if you don't know what that is it's basically like the cheerleaders have a routine the principals and like some other staff speak and then there's like games that go on and stuff it's really fun to watch classes technically start at 8 30 but we all have to be there for the pep fest like it's not an optional thing and then classes start and then my first period is hold on pre ap english 2a and then video art geometry a push and honor spanish 3a basically just like last year my schedule is not easy this year or like this try also 
Whose idea was it to make it so we have geometry, math, basically, all three trimesters? I'm not trying to do that, like, at all. It's not my vibe. I don't spin that way. Um, but it's okay because I'll, I'll get over it eventually, just not anytime soon. Next try is supposed to be easier. Also, bless whoever made my schedule because I have gym second try again and I was praying that I had it second try. If I didn't, I was going to try to switch into it. I like having my cute outfits first and third try. Second try when it's winter and cold, I don't care. I can wear sweatpants and hoodies to gym. Like, I don't care. Like, I would be wearing that anyway. Okay, so I'm like about done curling my eyelashes. I'm going to do my eyelashes and then I will see you guys right after and then I'll continue talking because I have stuff to catch up on. Okay guys, so obviously I can't wear this to school. I have to pick out an outfit. I don't know what it's gonna be and I have like a last resort outfit if none of my other ones seem good. I have to think because I practice after school and I have a pet vest so I honestly could just wear cuter outfits later on. So I could just wear something like simple-ish today. So then the other days when I don't have as much going on I can wear better outfits if you know what I mean. But I have some outfits like in my head, so I'm gonna show you what they are. Okay, so I have basically three outfit options, but I think I know which one I'm leaning more towards. It might not be the one that you guys think I'm gonna pick. Okay, so this is the first one. It's this top from H&M, it's ribbed, but it's like light heathered gray. If I wore that, I would wear it with this Princess Polly jean score. I like this thing because it's a skirt in the front, but given that it's shorts in the back and shorts under, I don't feel like uncomfortable in it in school. I love wearing these to school. The other option is these black jean shorts because they're the only ones I have. They're this plain gray white fox shirt, or I could wear it with this shirt from Princess Polly, which I actually think is what I want to do. It's basic and everything, but it's not too basic to where I feel like a bunch of people are going to be wearing it. I was thinking about this with my mom last night and I was like, okay, you know how in class on the first day they are always like, okay, like write three fun facts about you. I never know what to say. Like, I think I'm gonna get into the outfit that I have picked out in my head and then we'll figure out if I'm gonna straighten or curl my hair because I feel like curling my hair looks better. The front pieces won't stay, so I'll have to tuck it behind my ears regardless. kind of want to eat breakfast first because I'm very hungry. Okay, I'm gonna get into my outfit. Okay, so this is my outfit. I'm gonna put jewelry on still and I still have to do my hair. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, where'd the ponytail go? Luckily, I wear the same jewelry every day, so I already know what I'm doing for that. I'm gonna wear these gold chunky hoops. These are just from Old Navy. I got these when I went to the mall in my one of my recent vlogs, I don't know. Okay, so I got my jewelry on. I literally don't have bracelets. This is the final outfit. I think I'm gonna straighten my hair because I feel like everybody curls their hair on the first day of school. I just know that my hair's not gonna hold well, especially going into a hot gym for an hour. But that's okay because I can always curl my hair literally any other day. If I straighten my hair, it takes me like three minutes and then I have time to curl Aubrey's hair because she has been asking for me to curl her hair since like the beginning of summer. I need to make sure I smell good today. I'm not trying to stink. I packed a whole bag. I think I got a big bruise on me. Do you guys see a bruise on me? Probably not. It's 6.11 right now. I'm gonna go downstairs and make some breakfast. Straightening my hair was like I was breaking a sweat. I'm gonna put dry shampoo in my hair. I washed it yesterday, but it helps keep volume. Okay, but literally I'm leaving. It's gonna be my scent combo. This is from Pacifica. I filled up my water bottle. All I have to do is get my lunch from the fridge. I'm gonna go to school. I hope you guys enjoy this video and have an amazing day. Bye.